Welcome to Chef Frank's Great American Grill. I'm Chef Frank Dallariva. Stay tuned. Today we're going to prepare pan-seared hog snapper with sour cream polenta. Welcome back to Chef Frank's Great American Grill. We'll get started again with our hog snapper dish. The first thing we're going to do is add two cups of heavy cream, one cup of milk, just a pinch of salt, a little dollop of butter, say about a half an ounce. And we're going to bring that to a boil. Okay, once it comes to a rolling boil, we're going to add five ounces of the instant polenta and just keep whisking it as it comes along. Just keep giving it a good stir. It's just about there. Okay, you're going to turn the flame off. Now we're going to add about two ounces of sour cream. and another pinch of salt. Just whisk it again. Okay. And we're gonna pour it into our pan now. Because we're gonna want it we're gonna want to let it set for about a half an hour. We're gonna first start again with the Spanish olive oil. If you can see it has a nice beautiful green color to it. Okay. Now we're gonna add this is some sliced garlic. It's about two cloves of garlic. Slice it real thin. Okay. Okay, we're gonna put in one one diced uh, shallot. About two ounces of fennel. And give it a twirl. A little bit of salt for flavor. And just let that cook down for about 30 seconds. You wanna get the fennel to a soft stage. Okay, once that starts. We're going to just give it a splash of white wine. There we go. All the white wine does, it's, it, cools the, it cools the oil down. We'll stop the garlic from cooking because it's just at the stage that you want it to be at. Okay, next is uh, two ladlefuls of chicken stock. You can use the canned chicken stock that you find in the supermarket store. This is just a little bit of butter, I'd say about an ounce. And the butter is going to thicken your sauce up. I'm going to put in a little house-made tomato sauce. And the last, we're going to put some uh, fresh olive in there. And we're just, we're just going to reduce this now. Just going to thicken and solidify your sauce. Okay, last but least, we're going to finish with some fresh basil. And some fresh chives. Okay, here we have our hog snapper. Now I have two fillets. One I took the skin off of it, and the other one I left the skin on it. If you do prefer to cook it with the skin on, just give it three nice skewer marks here. Cook it in a real hot pan, and the skin will crisp up. It'll be delicious. The other way, I just brushed it with whole butter. I'm going to cook it butter side down, and it'll also give it a nice, a nice uh, golden crisp flavor to, to it. Okay, we're going to, again, start with a little olive oil in the pan. Again, you want to get the pan nice and hot, okay? We're going to cook it skin side down. Put a little salt on the, on the filet. I just like to add a little whole butter because it gives it a nice crispness to it. Okay. Okay. So we cooked it one, one minute on, on the first side. Now we're going to flip it. Just tilt your pan so all the oil runs this way and flip it that way. See that nice, nice color to that fish? Beautiful. Okay, now we're going to... We're going to finish it with a little white wine. And you could turn the flame off. We're going to pull this fish off now. And we're going to prepare the final stages of the dish. We're going to plate the dish now. So we have our polenta. We're going to take a nice big dollop of this polenta. See how it almost comes out like, like ice cream? Okay. We're going to put that down. Then the fish. See, very simple but extravagant. And then I like to, I like to finish it with just one of these edible orchids. This is how we prepare the pan-seared hog snapper with sour cream polenta 
at Chef Frank's Great American Grill, located in the Hilton Garden Inn on Worthington Avenue in West Palm Beach. Thanks for watching.